choose how long before your Apple Watch 7 returns to the clock face for an open app. So first let's go back to your clock face by pressing on the digital crown on the side button right here. So press on it again to go back to the watch face. Now from the watch face, press on the crown button. Then in the app screen, tap on the settings icon. In here, tap on general. Then we go down and tap on return to clock. To clock. And in here, you can choose always after two minutes, which is the default and after one hour. So let's see if I choose always. And you can see here it says Apple Watch will return to the clock face on whisk down. So if I put the watch say down, you can see it will go back to the watch face as soon as I put my whisk down. Okay, so if I press on the side button to go back into settings, in here I can choose after two minutes and if I put it down, you can see it's still uh, show me I'm um, in settings. And that is how you can change it. Now, if you go down, you can also customize these settings for individual app as well. So say if I want to uh, lift the blood oxygen, oxygen and I don't want to use the default, I would like to set a custom uh, settings. In here, I can choose say after one hour or always. So I select something different. So while using the blood oxygen app, if I put my wrist down, it will basically um, put my uh, watch back to the clock face. Uh, whereas if I uh, choose another app where it uses the default settings, then it will wait for after two minutes. And that's it. So uh, this is how you can set uh, how long your watch will wait before returning back to the clock face. Finally, you can press on the crown button to go back to your app screen or press on it again to go back to the watch face. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.